2020 was challenging, but we made it. And we got through it together. But what will 2021 be like? Not sure you can go through another year like 2020? Well, you can. And the fifth graders in my class are here to share with you some tips on creating a New Year's resolution and ways to keep those resolutions all year long. But first, let's do the Pledge of Allegiance. This is Ms. Eldridge's class. Please stand and say the Pledge of the Allegiance with us. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, to the republic, a nation, to God, indivisible, liberty and justice for all. My name is Mia from Ms. Eldridge's fifth grade class, and today I'm here to teach you what a New Year's resolution is. A New Year's resolution is a goal or accomplishment that you want to achieve over the next year. Now let's see some tips to help you accomplish that goal. First, you can color your mood. All you have to do is to think about your mood. Then, color your white piece of paper with your colorful emotions. For example, if you're in a good mood, you could color in with light colors like yellow, pink, pale blue, and more. On the other hand, when you're upset, you could color with dark colors like dark blue, purple, black, and lots of other colors that are dark. And when you're done, you'll be happier than ever. Second, you could play games with your family. For example, you could play tag in your backyard or fun board games that you like. You could even make up a game and be creative. Last, you can cook or bake for your family treats. You can get a permission from your family member to buy ingredients for your homemade treats and bake them. Or you could help your parents cook breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Bye. Hope you enjoyed. Well, she's got the bowl of candy sitting right there. I'm sorry, I just wanted a piece. You wanted a piece? You took the whole bowl. That's one of my New Year's resolutions is to not eat so much candy, but I just don't think I'm going to be able to accomplish it. Well, three things that I have for you is first, you have to believe in yourself, and then maybe have a piece of candy every other day instead of having a piece of candy every day, and then lower it to having it two times a week, and then keep on lowering it so it's easy for you to accomplish your New Year's resolution. Oh, thank you, Maria. I'll totally do that. resolutions. For example, my new year resolution is keep my room clean and organized. For example, let's say you're doing an arts and craft project and you're finishing doing it and you just leave it there. No, that's just going to make it harder on you. And when you're done with it, clean your area up and then put it right back right back where it goes. It's so much easier and don't spend hours on cleaning it up. So that's what I'm going to try doing. Bye! My new year's resolution is to play the Harry Potter theme song on the trumpet. Hi, my name is Charlie, and my New Year's resolution is to get more exercise. Ways that I am going to do that is to ride my bike, go on my trampoline, and walk my dog, and use exercise equipment from my house. My New Year's resolution is going to be to spend more time with my family and friends. Oh, and my New Year's resolution is to eat healthier. Happy New Year!